It's home! All right, so we get to kind of see what we're going to do in this spot up in here. I got like a gold on with a little yellow tail right now. Um, it usually pays off pretty well. But we got a cold front coming at us right now. Oh, that wind's kind of pushing me back a little bit. Um, we got a cold front coming in. It's supposed to get like a foot of snow in some areas tomorrow. Some areas it's just going to rain. Hopefully around here it just rains. But we're probably going to get a little bit of snow. But it's always warming up, so it'll go away. But anyways, the fish right now, that could be shut off. The bike could be shut down. We got that cold breeze blowing in. Uh, it could be ruining things, but I'm gonna use one of my old reliable spinners, just a gold with a yellow tail. Uh, if there's fish even interested in anything in here, this will pay off pretty well. This always does. It's got a hammered blade too. It probably weighs about, oh, I don't know, 10 grams. It's just a little over a quarter ounce. But it usually works out really well for me. Oh, not that, I got that a tree, I think. Nope, it didn't go in the tree. That's surprising. Fish on, boys, fish on. About freaking time. All right, what do we got here? I say she's a brownie. Just a little brownie. Yeah, yeah not huge. Oh, we got a brown trout, dudes. We got a fish. Oh, I turned this stupid camera on. Camera on. Camera is on. There it is. Not a monster, but it's a fish. We caught one finally. All right, boys and girls, there you go. Caught him on one of my spinners. You know, that's way you know the you know how the rules go. Caught him on a gold spinner. A little yellow deal. He's gonna be free, nice and easy. All right, dude. One more little piece, and we're out. All right. There you go, guys. Oh, little frisky brown trout. He wants to go. We're getting him back in the creek. There you go, dude. Have fun. Catch you later when you're like 20 pounds. Gold and yellow it is. These guys are trying to hug the shoreline, I guess. Hope that we hope for the best here. Oh, fish on, fish on, fish on. Woohoo, fishy, fishy, fishy. All right, we'll get this guy up in the bank. I got throw my net ready right away. Check it out, man, it's brown trout. All right, we'll get you in the net, bud. It'll be a little easier for you. There we go. All right, guys, get my hands wet here. Get my other hand wet here. This guy's barely hooked, so it should be a pretty easy extraction here. All right. Well, not a giant, but you know, what the heck, I'll take him. Fish is a fish. All right, dude, you're barely hooked. You got lucky on that one. You almost freed yourself if you would have been one little spin more and you would have been out. All right, check it out, guys. Look at that then, beautiful colors. Nice little brown trout. Someday he's gonna be a tank. But right now, he's just a little teeny boy. Look at his nice little everything. He's beautiful. Anyways, let's get him back in the creek. There he goes, there he swims off, whoa. He's happy, and I'm happy too. Check it out, man, it's just something I made. A gold spinner, little yellow tail on there for some excitement. And just a little hammer, number three blade. Probably weighs about, I don't know, 10 grand, maybe, 10 grand. Probably weighs about 10 grams. 10 grand. If I weigh 10 grand, I don't even think I can carry it right now. What the heck? So, I just wanted to say thank you to all my new subscribers. And I also wanted to say uh, thank you to any of my subscribers that have come from my eBay, uh, my eBay store. I have an eBay store and I sell spinner blades and lure parts. Um, I can make these things for people, but I really don't want to. What I want to do is just kind of like sell you the parts show you how to make them yourself, and then you just make your own. Um, I am I like it better this way. Otherwise, I'm gonna spend all summer in there uh, on a desk trying to make lures over and over again, making sure they're exact measurements and what a pain. So anyways, this is uh, all, all these parts are available at our store. Just there'll be a link in the description and I'll take you right to my store and you can check it out. So I just turned the camera on, you notice that? All right, no crud, no boogers on the lens, no weird hairs. Okay, time to get moving up through here, see what else we can catch. Can't believe I didn't turn the camera on. Ooh, I hit the bridge, like, that was an awesome shot, I tell you. I don't know what that was. Ooh, a fish, I got a fish too, check it out. I got a fish right out, it fell off the bridge, it hit the bridge, and then it fell off the bridge, and then it landed in the water, and then I caught a brown trout. Oh, dude, that's like, that's so cool. I can't believe I got that on video. 
that thing hit the bridge and then it fell straight down. And then this chucklehead here decided that he wanted to eat it. All right, we'll just get him over here to the bank quick. Well, it was lucky right there. We have to get this hook out of his mouth. Where is my hemo? All right, guys, I get my hands wet here. I'll show you I'm here in a second after I get him free. All right, dudes, check it out, man. This guy here, he's looking beautiful. We gotta send him back downstream and let him go. All right, dude, see you later. Thanks for hanging out. Well, there you go. It's like four fish now, so. Oh, I just went to the I just went to the mud right here all the way up to my kneecap. I mean, if you want to see, look at that. It's all the way up to my knee. I gotta pull my leg out here. I get a good grip on the oh, solid bottom without losing my boot. There we go. Oh, I got it back. You want to get strong and get in a shape? Come out here and do this kind of stuff because when you're fighting currents all day long, stepping in giant mud holes, it's like people say, oh, that's got to be such a great way to fish. It's so much relaxing, so much fun. It is. It's fun. It's blast. But if you're not in shape, you're not going to do so good. Fish on! Fish on! I hope I get this guy. This guy feels nice. Whoa, we're going to jump out of the water. Holy Toledo, let me get the net on him. I don't think he's going out anywhere. Whoa, come here, dude. Come here, get the net. Whoa, check it out, man. Oh, oh I got him. Look at that guy. Whew, I got to get over here and find a spot to set my rod down. There's a little rock here I can sit on. I think I'll be okay. Wow, check out this dude. Holy Toledo, he's nice. Yeah, and he doesn't have it in a gill plate, so he should be okay. He's got a little bit in his bottom lip, so we'll get him free here real quick. I gotta get my hemo out here, do a little discount surgery. Whew, all right, guys. Whew, this guy here is amazing. He's like one of the best fish so far today. Let me get my uh, measuring tape out here, see what I can do. All right, this guy here is 15 inches. That's probably one of the nicer ones today. Whoa, 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 hold on, dude. We're getting free in about a second. Check him out. Oh, I think he knocked my camera back even. Smudges on it. Yeah, who cares? Look at the size of this dude. He's Now look at the size of this dude. He's 15, man. Whoa, 15 inches. Now I guess he wanted to show you the other side. He didn't like that side of his profile, so he switched around on me. But anyways, we'll get this guy back in the creek. It's a pretty sweet fish. All right, dude, have fun. Wow, he just swam right over there, right into the pool. Wow, that was pretty fun. 15 inches, man, 15 inches is pretty cool. I think I said 15 inches. <sighs> All right, guys, that was a blast. Now we have to keep on moving. <sighs> boy, oh boy, I wish it was a season. I took that guy home and put him in my smoker. See what we got going on. Oops, I'm chasing it. Oh, look at it. He got him. I seen it. He chased it right up. All right, I got this guy for sure. This guy can get off. Oh, come on. Get in the net. All right. Woohoo. This has been fun. All right, we got to get over here and find a spot where I can kind of sit down for a second. Maybe I'll sit in the mud over here. It looks like a good spot to sit. All right, I'm gonna get that bail out a little bit because I can't wreck the new fishing lean pole and stuff, you know? So. All right, dude, here we go. If you can check it, you'll be my best buddy. All right, camera on, camera's on. All right, let's get this guy free. He's not a tank, he's not a giant. I'd say probably, well, I don't know, 10 inches. Oh, and there he goes into the creek, he's gone. All right, well, you've seen him in the net before I <sighs> boy, oh boy, what a pain. Oh well, that was fun. Now I catch another one. Well, hey, there you go, man. That was the first six hour hike of the year. I started off at like probably nine o'clock this morning and I walked up in there until like three. I could have kept on going, but I ran out of memory card. Right now, 
I'm on borrowed time with this memory card. I think there's like 10 minutes left and then it's gonna just gonna go dead. So anyways, I thought I would pull over the side road. This is always my favorite little place to do my outros usually. It's not windy and like it is now. And it's uh, just a nice out of the way place where I'm not gonna run into any cars. That's why I was here. So that's why you always, if you look around, you might recognize this spot. This is the spot I'm always at. Anyways, thanks for taking along with it was a lot of fun to catch a lot of nice fish. It was all pretty decent, and that was like a totally new area I've never hiked through before. I've never been there. Now I know where there's some good holes at when summertime comes around, you know? It's like, anyways, there's gonna be a head over here. There's gonna be a playlist over here. Go check out the tips, tricks, and techniques of places that I fish in the Driftless. Places like I went today, a nice six hour hike. It could have been faster. I probably could have done it in four, but I just took my time. And when I got a few holes, I just, 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 just had some fun for a while, catch some nice fish. but. Anyways, thanks for taking along, and I will see you on the next episode. Thanks for coming along.